This is a quest to find the risk takers, those who won't take no for an answer, holding bravery in their bones, shaping ideas not to own, but to hone and hand to the next touch point, a collective catalyst that catapults us forward. It's your time. The dawn of a new day resets the clock. 1,440 minutes unfolding. 24 hours, all hours to hold. Be bold with, break molds or split strongholds. Cause let's face it, the day is only what you make it. So are you sitting, posting, and double tapping or making things happen? Perhaps when it starts with a plan, a spark, the ideal or experience that moved you to embark, then fuel it with faith. Charge it with grit. Let passion be your very first investment. See, this is a call to us all. Cause one man don't make the movement. It's the movers and shakers that disrupt our complacency and shatter the status quo. Redefining industries, the revision of missions that manifest the things that matter, making us buy in. No longer a commodification, but self-determination by the ones who uproot inequity and plant seeds that breed new perspectives. The non-conformists, free enough to shift systems making radical the new norm. The peacemakers who revere life and dance in the face of death, daring the numb to feel again and heal in spite of their pain. Those skilled with tools to thread together a tight-knit tomorrow, steady enough to capture social movements in a snapshot, dope enough to celebrate life in this black and white world. Powerful enough to unlock the prison imposed and planned like promise is a birthright. Fem enough to flex on football and fitness while shattering every glass ceiling. Those who mobilize, who motivate, who congregate and manifest the village, become mouthpiece and speak to the multitude. The intelligent and magnetic that galvanize polar opposites. The courageous who won't let fear get in the way of progress. See, they run, not walk to make an impact. Picking up piece by piece. Reimagining bit by bit. Building a future where we all can fit. Waking up every morning with love and on purpose. But the question is to you, listen, but still sitting there, are you doing enough? When's the last time you did something larger than yourself?